Klaus Philipp Maria Graf Schenk von Stauffenberg was born on November 15th of 1907 and died July 21st of 1944 at the age of 37. He had five children, three sons and two daughters. He also had a wife named Nina Schenk Grafen von Stauffenberg, who he was married to for ten years. Klaus joined the Nazi military because he had originally agreed with the idea of rebuilding post-World War I Germany. However, when he discovered what the Nazi party's full intentions were, he decided to join the resistance. He stayed in the Nazi regime and even became a high-ranking member in order to attend meetings that Hitler attended with the intent of eventually pulling off an assassination, which did not succeed, as we know. One of the things that makes Klaus von Stauffenberg an upstander of the Holocaust is the fact that he was directly linked to Hitler's assassination attempt. The assassination attempt involved Klaus planting a bomb inside of Hitler's suitcase. However, the attempt was not successful, and Klaus was executed. The Nazis declared Klaus's family share the blood of the traitor, and they were put into concentration camps. Klaus Philipp Maria Graf Schenk von Stauffenberg tried to kill Hitler in order to save Germany from a vicious dictator. Stauffenberg's efforts showed that being an upstander can get taken too far despite having good